Hey everyone and welcome to our kickboard breakdown. Today I'm going to be talking about the five different styles of kickboards and point out what makes them different from one another due to how they've been designed. So let's get straight into it. The classic kickboard is a great one to pick up if you want to start swimming with a kickboard. Using this type of board will get used to the shape, the feel and the positioning that it has to offer. Then you can really concentrate on building up your leg strength rather than worrying about where you've put your hand or whether it's in the right angle on the board. Classic boards tend to be made from either foam so they're lightweight and won't irritate your skin and of course are non-toxic, which is nice. So just imagine a classic kickboard, but smaller. That's the mini kickboard. Now these have been designed for children and young adults, but also small frame adults have a tendency of using them too. Due to them being for children, they tend to come with bright colors and designs. So that the Zorg Superhero range and the Peppa Pig range. Don't worry though, they aren't all like this. Uh, just take a look at the Finnish Junior or the Zorg's Mini. So mini boards are starting to come with grip holes and are becoming more hydrodynamic. So one day there'll be lots of styles, cuts and designs to choose from. These are of course based on the design of the classic kickboard but with two grip holes located at the front part of the board. Now these grips have two functions. One, they increase your overall grip of the board and two, they allow to hold the board in different positions when training. Uh, the Maru Fitness Board is a great one to look at and also is the Speedo Kickboard. But to be completely biased, the Simply Swim Kickboard is the best on the market, if not the greatest kickboard in the world. I can say that, can't I? These boards have been designed in a particular way to make them, and by extension you, more streamlined in the water. They'll push your training further than a classic or a grip hole board. These types of boards are a racer's favourite as it works well with keeping them more streamlined in the water. The coolest hydrodynamic boards to look at are the Speedo Elite Kickboard and the Bico Hydrodynamic Board, which I might add comes in a bunch of cool colours. So these types of boards really have been created for two functions in mind. The first is of course a kickboard, and the second is a pool boy. These boards are great for doing a bit of open water swimming, or if you just want to reduce your pack size, because well, it's two for one, why wouldn't you? Uh, the pool kick just looks like a mini kickboard, but of course has the groove in the middle, you know, to give it that pool boy shape. And the keel on the other hand does look something a lot different, but to be honest with you, I kind of like it. It's nice to see a bit of something a bit different when it comes to swimming equipment. Of course, both work perfectly as a kickboard and as a pool boy. So like I said earlier, they're great if you're looking to reduce your overall pack size. And there we have it, our kickboard breakdown. Hope this has helped you out. Did I miss anything out? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.